you had me worried, really, really worried with a small box. I was really, really worried, but again, you you hit it out of the park. Wow, um, you know, really cool items. You've really, I mean, the more I like this is what I like about Fry Crate is they're really thought out items. You know, they don't. He doesn't just chuck any old crap in there. He literally, you know, goes round and he, you know, chooses the stuff that you know true horror fans would like and that's what i like about jay and the fact that you know we've become really good friends you know he's we've messaged each other a couple of times and you know he's he's been in contact with me to make sure i'm okay and that means a lot to me that does you know that means a hell of a lot when you haven't got a lot of family it's nice to know that i have got extended fan family you know like jay like marie you know she's another one you know it's nice to know that i you know somewhere you know people do give a crap about me other than you know obviously anna you know she does anyway i mean uh, other people i mean the cool thing about the shirt as well he could have gone down and, and you know it could have been like you know a picture of like the, the the VHS sleeve, which would would which would have been cool, but he didn't. You know, he went. He fought outside the box. We got a picture of the of Doc, you know, the of Decker, which is really cool. I mean, that's a it's a really. I mean, and the thing is, he's a really cool character. I'd like to see him turn up in a couple of other films. I know if you've seen Nightbreed, you obviously know what happens to him, but it would be cool to see him in other video in other films. That would be really cool because he's a really cool character and it's, it's, it's such a shame that you know he didn't he didn't have a very big part but yeah like i said you had me worried then jay really worried with a small box but like i said it's not always about what's you know the size of things let me just quickly have a look what the other thing was because i lost my train of thought then it happens i'm getting old well no i shouldn't say i'm getting old i am old let me have a look so we search Fright Crate. Let's have a look. Uh, yeah, oh, that's it, right. So it's Day of the Dead. It, Terror Vision, which I haven't seen, which I do need to see. It's on my favourite list. I will be watching it, I will watch it before I get the box, I promise. And the last thing is Death Dexter. Now, the thing is, we tried to get into Dexter. We tried to watch Dexter. And we just couldn't, just couldn't get into it. We just really could not get into it. Um, and I don't know why. It's it's strange because it, it, it's right up our street. You know, it's right around my street. You know, it's, it's you know, serial killer. You don't know, don't know the story of it, basically. He's a forensics uh, for the police. Works with blood. Uh, but he's also a serial killer as well. And... Like I said, so that should have been gold. I don't know, it's just something about it. it. Just We just could not get into it. We watched a couple of seasons, so we gave it a good chance. Excuse me, we gave, gave it a good couple of chances. You know, we, we, we watched, it, I think, three seasons we watched. And we just, we just couldn't get into it. So I'll see what the stuff is and see if it's cool. No doubt it will be because, you know. And then the thing is, again, you don't see, many, you don't see much of that stuff about. Anyway, I've rambled on like I normally have. Um, I'm going to go and get back to Nerd Block and see what they're going to do. And hopefully, fingers crossed, I'll be able to get it. The wounder thing about it is because the uh, see the horror block is fine. They can stick whatever in that is. It, it doesn't matter. You know, they they got must be got tons of stuff, stuff they can stick in there. But with the Comic Con box, there was that was exclusive stuff. That you could only get through that box. So if I've missed out on that, I'm going to be really pissed off. Yeah, if they give me a refund, great. But I'll be really pissed off because I really, really wanted that box. Because, you know, it was seven seven exclusive items and an exclusive pop as well. I mean, even if they didn't like the pop, I could stick it on eBay and get 20 quid, 25 quid, you know. So anyway, I'm going to go and speak to Nerdblock. Um, I will catch you all in a bit. Drop a like on the video if you liked it. So have a check out my other videos there might be something you like subscribe if you want to that's awesome i'd love to if you subscribe 
Um, if you're already subscribed to me, make sure you check the bell. Uh, that will tell you exactly when my next video is coming. And I will catch you all on the flip side. Wiley out. Bye, guys. Say goodbye. Bye. Yeah. Hi, guys. Wiley here. Lovely Anna. Can you join us today for my fright crate unblock unboxing? Um, that's bear with me. I'm a bit peed off today. I'm not really in the mood. Um, I'm still waiting for my Comic Con box from Nerd Block. Um, and they haven't come. Apparently, it's in the country, <coughs> but. It's not here. So I've messaged them on Facebook, so hopefully, fingers crossed, it'll come. Um, I've got to say, this box looks a bit small. Uh, seems to be getting smaller and smaller. And last month was quite small as well. So, I don't know. I'm really sorry I'm not with it. I'm really not. Anyway, just like I said, this is Fried Crate for April. If you want your box for yourself, I'll leave a link below. You have to get them quick because they sell out really quick. I think May's or it might already be sold out to be perfectly honest. Um, but I'll leave a link below, you can go and check it out. So I'll do this blind like they always do. Paper. So we've got a t-shirt on top, so I'll grab a t-shirt while Anna grabs it off me. And we have I see now I was hoping that this was the uh, no breed item. That's cool, man. That's really cool. No breed shirt. We've got the Doctor. Decker, I think his name is. There you go. From uh, No Breed. And the main, like, evil thing from there. A pretty kick ass t shirt, actually. I really like that. Nice one, Jake. That's awesome. Um, the things, the themes this month were Nightbreed, They Live, Chucky, uh, well, Charles playing, um, and I think Texas Chain to Massacre 2, I think. And then there were extra items, but they were what you call it. Can I have an extra item, please? Aha, <laughs> <laughs> I got an extra item. That's too cool. It's one of the extra items, that's cool. And as happy as well, because I don't, I don't like gremlins as well, but... Yeah. Chloe? Yeah? I'm recording. What? Shh! I'm recording. Oh, that's really cool. Thank you, Jay, for throwing an extra thing in for me. That's really cool. That'll look, that'll look cool on the, on the fridge. Thank you for that, man. Nice one. Thank you. Thanks, item, please. Oh, the Adam family. Oh, here we go. Oh, is that an actual from the actual film? It is. Ah, oh, cool. We have an actual um from the film. We got Gomez, Morticia, Lurch, and the grandma. I don't know what the grandma's name is. I think it just might be Granny. That's pretty cool. With a uh, Wednesday. Actually, I do need a uh, new bookmark because I don't know where mine is. Um, that's cool. Um, I've started reading the Jack the Ripper book. It's quite good. <coughs> okay. We have the sunglasses. The Obey sunglasses are cool, man. From They Live. Now, this is a bit of a nightmare because that's really cool. I can't really wear these. As you can see, I wear glasses myself. So I'll put them on and we'll have a look. Oh, that looks really, that looks really strange. Oh, God, I was, I was one of the aliens. Oh, God. I mean, if I was, if I, if I could, if I could see, that would be freaky. What the hell? Have you got a... She's definitely one of the aliens. Have you got a thingy? Bottle over here in the, in the cupboard. I can't in, see I've opened, have a look. I just did this on the drawer. Just go and find one. There's Pac-Man on the fridge. Careful with it. Pac-Man's one. On the fridge. 
No, you gotta try one, darling. Mm. Oh, can I try one? No. No, they give me a headache. No, that's all right. It's just a bit of black. They still give me a headache. Black is there. Okay. There you go. There you go, Anna's rocking her. Uh... They're just dots. Yeah, it is, yeah. They're pretty cool. That's a, that's a, that's a fun item. So. Hey, they're cool as a fun Maybe item. Aliens, thanks. <laughs> they're pretty cool, actually. Like I said, they're a cool, like, throwaway item. You know, a good, uh, not throwaway item, but a good, uh, fun item. Yeah. Next item, please. Ah, the pin, cool. Ah, oh, cool. That's awesome. Ah, oh, near block. Here we go. Cool. I'm going to do that in a minute. That's really cool. That's the... Um, that's cool. It's... um, What's his name? I can't remember his name. But it's the brother to the Leatherface. That's a pretty cool pin. I like that pin. That's cool. It's different. You know? That's what I like about Cray. It's different. That's really cool. I really like that pin. That's cool. Next item, please. What's on it? Oh, we've got everything else. <coughs> oh, here we go. What's this? This month on Friday, we're pleased to present you with a celebrity Ed Gallon of Oh, cool! That's ace! Wow! Well, you know what? That's awesome! It's basically the guy who plays Chucky, as in the Chucky doll, when he's um, running around. That is pretty cool! If you receive a golden autograph in your box, you'll, you, can get a, you can get a Skype call with Ed Gale. Oh, that's awesome! There's only five of them. Yeah. That is pretty oh, look, cool. Let me open this up and have a look. Let's have a look. Because that is just pretty cool. I haven't got a gold one, but I don't care because that is really cool. That's ace. That's going on the wall. That's gonna go. That's gonna. That's gonna. I'm gonna frame that. That's gonna go on the wall. There you go. We got the guy who played actually played Chucky the doll. Ed Gale. That is awesome. That's a cool Chucky item. That's going on the wall. We've got a certificate of authenticity as well. But that is going on the wall. I'm going to find a frame small enough. I'm sure I can find one somewhere. And that's going on the wall. Because that is cool. That is pretty cool. I'm, I'm really chuffed about that. That's a really cool item. Is that it? Oh, we got a print. Oh, yeah. This is the uh, Scott, Scott Striker. Wow. Actually, you know what I could do? Can I take that out of there? Does it come out? It does. What I could do, um, I'm hoping to go to a uh, um, film at Comic Con in June. So, what I'm going to, well, I'm this, and Jeffrey Coombs. Is going to be there. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this along with me. And see if he can sign it for me. Because that is amazing. That is an amazing drawing. I wish I could draw like that. That's that's stunning. From Reanimator obviously. Three. Number three of 250. That's really cool. That's a really uh, low one. That's awesome. That is amazing. Thank you Jay. That's awesome man. That's That's so cool. And I could take, like I said, I could take that with me now. Instead of taking my figure off the wall, I can take this. And uh, get this signed instead. If I can get him to sign in there, look. Wow. Next, is that it? Okay, then what was in the box? Exclusive Scott Stryker. I'm feeling a little bit happier now. That's awesome. Uh, Scott Striker print. Herbert West. Exclusive art print from one of today's sought-after artists. Exclusive only to Food Crate. Fruit crate? Fruit crate. This gorgeous print will reanimate your eyes. Signed, bagged, and numbered. Wicked. That's cool. If you get loads of fruit in your next yeah. fight, blow him in. Yeah. 
exclusive photo Chucky autograph from the character actor Ed Gale, the one who portrayed the iconic character Chucky, to Howard the Duck. He was Howard the Duck as well. That's cool. Uh, he's an illustrious career with a span from horror to fantasy sci-fi. He is, uh, his notable works include Phantasm 2, Friday the 13th series, Dolly Dearest, Survival Island is telling, etc. Stay tuned for pictures of the signing on social media. Wow. Five lucky win winners will receive a golden autograph in their crate. The ones that, that will do will get a free Skype call with the man himself. That's cool. That's cool, man. That's cool. Um, excl exclusive Obey custom graphic sunglasses. Unique and fun item allows you to spot the formaldehyde faces. Bubblegum not included. That sucks. Could have put some bubblegum in. Um, but then again, it's like you said, I'm all out of bubblegum. Uh, exclusive Decker shirt. This is an exclusive fire shirt that make take the Midian featuring the Ruthless Doctor, who is a death, who is death pain and simple. Yeah, he is. Decker, man. Awesome. I knew it was Doctor Decker. I knew it was Decker. Exclusive psychedelic enamel pin. Chop, chop, top. That's his name. Lick my plate. I think we'll pass. This pin inspired from the TCM. Which is Texas Chainsaw Massacre 2 features the chibi version of Chop Top. That's cool. And then we got X. I got, I got two extras. I got the Adam Family Values, which was a film cell, and I got the Gizmo. See, I, I wouldn't have been bothered about the Universal Monsters. I mean, it's, it'd be cool, but I'm really happy about what I got. That's awesome. And that's that. We got no. Oh, for, for May. I can remember this now because I'm normally. I'm really crap at remembering things. Should have put the box back up. I'm gonna put the stuff back in, don't I? Let me think. Right for May, I think it. Terrorvision, Dawn, Day of the Dead, not Dawn of the Dead, Day of the Dead, and oh, what was the other item? Let me have a quick look. Let me phone. I gotta say, Jay, you've done it again. Yeah, you, yeah I, I was a little bit worried. This, you had me worried this time. I'll leave that out because I'm good. You had me worried this time, Jay, with a small... You had me worried, really, really worried with a small box. I was really, really worried. But again, you you hit it out of the park. Wow. Um, you know, really cool items. You've really... I mean, what I like... This is what I like about Fry Crate. Is they're really thought-out items. You know, they don't... He doesn't just chuck any old crap in there. He literally... You know goes round and he you know chooses the stuff that you know true horror fans would like and that's what i like about jay and the fact that you know we've become really good friends you know he's we've messaged each other a couple of times and you know he's he's been in contact with me to make sure i'm okay and that means a lot to me that does you know that means a hell of a lot when you haven't got a lot of family it's nice to know that I have got extended fan family, you know, like Jay, like Marie, you know, she's another one, you know. It's nice to know that, I, you know, somewhere, you know, people do give a crap about me. Other than, you know, obviously Anna, you know, she does anyway. I mean, uh, other people. I mean, the cool thing about the shirt as well, he could have gone down and, and you know, it could have been like, you know, a picture of like the, the the VHS sleeve, which would would which would have been cool, but he didn't. You know, he went he fought outside the box. We got a picture of the of Doc, you know, the of Decker, which is really cool. I mean, that's a it's a really I mean, and the thing is, he's a really cool character. I'd like to see him turn up in a couple of other films. I know if you've seen Nightbreed, you obviously know what happens to him, but it would be cool to see him in other video in other films. That would be really cool because he's a really cool character, and it's, it's, it's such a shame that you know he didn't he didn't have a very big part. But yeah, like I said, you had me worried, NJ, really worried with the small box. But like I said, it's not always about what's you know the size of things. Let me just quickly have a look what the other thing was because I lost my train of thought then. It happens. I'm getting old. Well, no, I shouldn't say I'm getting old. I am old. Let me have a look. So we search Fright Crate. Let's have a look. Uh, yeah, oh, that's it, right. So it's Day of the Dead. It's Terror Vision, which I haven't seen, which I do need to see. It's on my favourite list. I will be watching it, I will watch it before I get the box, I promise. And the last thing 
is Def Dexter. Now, the thing is, we tried to get into Dexter. We tried to watch Dexter. And we just couldn't, just couldn't get into it. We just really could not get into it. Um, and I don't know why. It's it's strange because it, it it's right up our street. You know, it's right around my street. You know, it's it's you know serious because I don't know if another story of it. Basically, he's a forensics uh, for the police. Works with blood, uh, but he's also a serial killer as well, and. Like I said, so that should have been gold. I don't know, it's just something about it. It just we just could not get into it. We watched a couple of seasons, so we gave it a good chance. Excuse me, we gave it, gave it a good couple of chances. You know, we we, we watched it I think three seasons we watched. And we just we just couldn't get into it. So I'll see what the stuff is and see if it's cool. No doubt it will be, because you know and then the thing is again, you don't see many, you don't see much of that stuff about. Anyway, I've rambled on like I normally have. Um, I'm going to go and get back to Nerd Block and see what they're going to do. And hopefully, fingers crossed, I'll be able to get it. The wounder thing about it is because the uh, see the horror block is fine. They can stick whatever in that is. It, it doesn't matter. You know, they they got must be got tons of stuff, stuff they can stick in there. But with the Comic Con box, there was that was exclusive stuff. That you could only get through that box. So if I've missed out on that, I'm going to be really pissed off. Yeah, if they give me a refund, great. But I'll be really pissed off because I really, really wanted that box. Because, you know, it was seven seven exclusive items and an exclusive pop as well. I mean, even if they didn't like the pop, I could stick it on eBay and get 20 quid, 25 quid, you know. So anyway, I'm going to go and speak to Nerdblock. Um, I will catch you all in a bit. Drop a like on the video if you liked it. So have a check out my other videos there might be something you like subscribe if you want to that's awesome I'd love to if you subscribe um, if you already subscribed to me make sure you check the bell uh, that'll tell you exactly when my next video is coming and I will catch you all on the flip side Wiley out bye guys say goodbye bye